What's up, everybody, and welcome to Poppy Playtime. I'll be honest, I only learned this game existed today. Um, as of recording this, it is the day it got released. I know literally nothing beyond creepy dolls. And if you've seen my reactions to the Little Nightmares Asylum... Yeah, this is gonna be great. Things is gonna move, and I don't... Oh... Oh, it's like an episodic kind of thing? That's not what I expected. Alright. Chapter 1. A tight squeeze. As an employee... As an ex-employee of Playtime Co., you finally returned to the factory many years after. Everybody within disappeared. Fun. Don't see anything going wrong there. Wait. Uh, you are about to see the most incredible doll ever invented. Her name is Poppy, and she is the first truly intelligent doll in the world. A little girl can talk to her. Poppy gives her answers. She is the first doll actually able to have a conversation with a child. Hard to believe. Just watch. I thought we learned from Chucky that was a bad idea. Poppy Playtime! Poppy's as lovable as a real I'm getting so many Tattletale vibes like from this, too. and I don't like Hi, it. my name is Poppy. I love you. Can you help me polish my shoes? Why, of course, Poppy. Just like a real girl, Poppy always wants to look her best. Perfect! Thank you. Her hair is sturdy and won't come out when you brush it. And smells just like a poppy flower. Is there anything else you'd like to say, Poppy? I'm a real girl. Just like you. What's the time? I'm not a girl firstly, I'd like to say. And if you've ever wanted to see how all of the nation's favorite toys were created, play uh, oh, no. just two ninety nine of no. <laughs> hour in the most magical toy factory on earth. This is genuinely a phobia of mine. I cannot stand it. What the Oh yay! This is gonna be good. Uh Nice font, dudes. Looks very pretty. They, they took effort onto that. Is it just me or does the text... I can't tell if it's the ca like my, my view or if it's genuinely how the game works. For some reason, it looks like the text is moving. Find the flower to find the missing employees is what I got out of that. Welcome! Um. Oh, the sensitivity is not great on this. Hold up. Can I change 7 sensitivity? The answer is... No, we're stuck with it. Alright. Um. Pencils. The fuck is that noise? Is that a fan? Um. This TV. Oh! I picked up a thing. I picked up a VHS tape. Um. Put it in, I guess? Hi, my name is Lake Pierre. And I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime Co. Toy Factory. Why can't we see your face? Then you're trespassing. Yeah, we play this little tape on loop whenever we close the factory for the day. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high-quality toys and excellent child care, we also pride ourselves on our security. For example, this facility is full of hidden motion triggers, which set off, we'll turn on the factory's emergency alarms and directly contact the authorities. And that's one of the more aimed aspects of our security system. Um, no spoilers. So, you've got my warning. It's not too late to turn around. 
I just hope that you're certain whatever you're doing is worth it. Uh... Well, you heard the man. Time to leave. Evidently, this is not a place I want to be in. Did I? Alright, this is gonna suck. Well, obviously, I should check out security, right? Let's see that famed security of his. Um... I guess I need a code? Well, why don't I want to play with Poppy? Gift shop. Maybe the gift shop's oh, got something good. Oh, that's what I was hearing. It's a train. Hell happened this place? Looks like it's been ransacked. Black Friday was not nice to this place. Can I crouch? I can. I don't know if that'll help me at any point, but I'm sure as hell gonna use it. Oh! Boogie Bot! I heard a thing and now I'm scared. Alright. Oh. Oh. Uh, I expected that to let me through. Do I have to go through the other one? Huh. I genuinely thought that would let me in. Okay. Um. Green, pink, yellow, red. Is that it? That might be the code. I don't know. It's weird the gift shop would have. That is the... Why does the gift shop just give out the code. What is that? Oh, yay. Another tape. Um, the grab pack. Okay. Oh, is that what's in there? Oh. Yeah, don't like this game. Don't like it. Constantly checking behind me because I'm so... Ugh. Oh. Every small noise is causing massive paranoia. Oh. Uh. Apparently, don't fire the wire at people's heads. You might yank their head off. Good to know. Thank you, ominous television. Weirdly, this place has a lot of you. It's playtime! Uh, oh. oh. Yay. Um. Oh, that... Uh... Hold down to pull objects. Um, what can I pull? Can I... Hold up. What did I just do? Got a box. I guess. Oh, I really hate this already. I haven't even done anything. Wait. Game designers. I found an invisible barrier. Please don't be spooky. Ah. <sighs> 
Oh god. No, 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 no. Ah. Uh. Oh god. High five? That's. What did I just do? Uh. Playtime Co. has designed hundreds of distinct toys, but none connected with people more than that of Huggy Wuggy. Our founder, Elliot Ludwig, aimed to create a toy which could hug you forever. As is always true, Playing Co.'s four-step process to creating the most likable toy was a success. Um, your Huggy Wuggy, I guess? Oh, I don't like those eyes. Do not like those eyes. What? Just... Oh! He had a key. Thanks, Huggy. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, God. Can I just... leave? Whoa. Um... I may have clipped my head inside a door. <laughs> oh, I hate this game already. I really need to stop playing horror games. They creep the fucking shit out of me. I am not good with horror games. Fuck this, I'm leaving. Let me leave. Fuck this. I just want to leave. Let me out. Here's a thought. Let me pull down the train. Ah! Can't do half the things I want to do. All right. Uh, it's it's the intro of the game. I'm fine. Nothing can hurt me. Nothing can hurt me. Just gotta keep that mentality. I am invincible. Nothing can hurt me. I am safe. Nothing can hurt me. The hell am I using the key on? Oh! I guess power? Can I come in? Okay! I am safe. I cannot die. Um, I am safe. I do not need to be afraid. All is good. All is good? Ah! My arm's electrocuted. Good to know. Why is my arm electrocuted? I am... Um, evidently touching the wire with my body, how am I not dead? Uh... Oh. Oh, I get it. I meant to connect you guys up. Whoa, I just... I guess I turned down on the building. Good to know. Let me out. Fuck this. Just fuck this game. I knew it was gonna happen, too. It was so obvious. Oh. Where the hell is he? And I can't leave now. Great. Who the hell made the, like, business model for that guy? Hey, Huggy. How you doing, bud? Hot bop. Oh. 
Oh, uh, why? That got me. That genuinely got me. Did not like that. Oh. All right. I am safe. I. The hell did I just grab? A toy. Ugh. God. Damn, I hate this already. Screw you, you blue thing. Ah. Uh, hmm. Random buttons. Which, from what I tell, don't do anything. Um. What did I just pick up? It doesn't tell me. Good to know. Um. What did I just do? Oh, I have a head now. Actually, you know what? Get lost. Stop looking near me. Good. Um, oh yay, another VHS area. I guess I need to get it. I'll be honest, I really, the game's telling me to jump down, I don't want to jump down, I'm gonna have to jump down. Um, I don't even know what I set up. Uh-huh. Oh, that's the door that way. Okay. So I can go back. And there's another one. Oh, so I'm just collecting the four. Alright, so... Not that. Not that. There we go. Okay. So, I'm missing the red one. Right? Great. That did nothing. Um. You don't want to go down there. Mm. It's days like these that I really wonder, why do I keep putting myself through this? Why do I purposely expose myself to... <laughs> Alright, fine. You win game. Let me in. Oh, wait. Am I... Oh! I swore the game would have just told me to get in that hole, but... Eh. <laughs> Who am I complaining? What does that say? Bay 2? Plus so a day 2 for a second. Like... Alright. Oh! Um, don't I have another? Oh, that one didn't open anything. Okay, I'm really missing one. I know I'm missing one. Oh, every small noise is making me freak out. All right, where's where's the last thing? Come on, it's gotta be somewhere. Ah, sneaky little thing, you. And now the monster's gonna be behind the door, isn't he? Uh, no. Huggy wuggy. Go away. Um. What did I just turn? Oh. Is that the other hand? Why does it take four control cores to access this thing? Oh, um, can I pick it up? Oh. 
Okay. I have two hands. How did I misfire that one? Oh, wait. Oh, there's a... Oh, I get it now. There's a maximum amount of distance I can have them out. Game is so loud. At least for me. It's probably really quiet for you guys, but for me it's... Oh. Yep. Do not enter. Uh, grab to complete circuit? What circuit? Uh. I'm very confused, game. What, is there a power thing I've... Yes, I get it. Uh... Okay. Um... Ah! Um... I know I rolled down here. Link to that, and... Then press button? Whoa, okay. That moved me a lot faster than I was expecting. Where am I? Where am I? Doll bits. Oh, that's I. Oh, and I can't pick up you guys. Come on. You know what? I just gotta stop caring about self-preservation. Screw this. I know I'm gonna be fine. Needs power. Uh, make a friend. Our founder, Elliot Ludwig, was a visionary. He set the stage of all Playtime Co.'s greatest feats. Yet all of the amazing things that he created, the make a friend machine is one of the most creative, impressive, and advanced. It is solely responsible for nearly every Playco toy sold on the market to this day. All it needs to be fed is the proper parts and it'll paint, assemble, and do a quality inspection on the toy all on its own. Gone is the need of complex sorting or backbreaking labor. This machine can do it all and more. Am I gonna make myself a possessed doll? Because I'm not sure I want to do that. Like, if possible, I'd rather not do that. Oh, wait, was there like a secret in the other room with like an orange tape that I missed? Because there was an orange tape player, and now there's a pink... I missed a secret. There's secrets in this... There's bloody secrets. Hope the last one wasn't important. So, Stella, what made you want to work at the Playtime Co. Factory? Playing with toys when I was young was so magical. I could go straight from my bedroom floor to anywhere in the world. Was such a great feeling and being able to work at a toy factory somewhere that can provide kids with that same experience that's a pretty great feeling too sometimes though i really really wish i could go back to being a kid i mean and it's weird because adults are just kids but older i don't think anyone ever really feels like an adult but your body just gets older and older and then you die. Poof. <laughs> you You're way okay. You're way too okay with this. Forever. There's things though, like some trees that can stay alive even while being way older than the person. I mean, the oldest people to ever live are still younger than those. So 
Well, I guess everyone is always young when they do something. Right? Alright, I think we're getting a little off track. Now you're telling her she's getting off track? I think she got off track very quickly. Um, high five. That was weird. Um... Thank you. That's a power thingy. Uh... That's another power thing. I can move past this, though. And there's the button. Okay... There's meant to be, like, a power thing, right? Uh... I probably just missed it, then. Okay, so... Moving along. Um, so I guess it's you. Alright. Oh, I'm running out of length. Uh, let's go around here. And now I can't go further. Great. Um... So, there, there, no, that doesn't work, because it's going to be too far. Maybe like this, and then I can like, uh. hold up, alright, I think I got the solution. And I can pull this. There we go. Now I can. God damn it, this pulls in the way. Alright, hold up. So I've got to do this. Con connect. Connect. There we go. Don't bother trying any of that. Pull this. I can grab it. There we go. Then connect to. Um. Whoops. That was not my intent. Can I have my hand back? Thank you. There we go. Did it. Huh. Can I... Get up for science? Oh, I have health. See? Stupidity sometimes gets you results. That was science right there. I learned a thing. And that thing will probably help me live longer. Um, I guess I turn you on now. I thought it was just good. Alright. Wakey, wakey! God, you're loud on my end. Um... Nobody leaves without a toy. Ever heard of some... Oh, it's... Eat? That's... Uh, a butt? Yeah, that's a butt. And this is a... Uh, a head. Wait, am I making myself a companion? someone to help me survive the trials and tribulations of the toy factory. Oh, I want to see this happen. Quick, vomit up my child. Uh. Vomit up my child. Ooh, it painted it. It's still a horror game, so I still feel like I have to check around every corner. The fuck is that? 
All right, and then that gets eaten. You're gonna assemble it and then poop them out. Whoever built this place is very eccentric, I'll say that much. Ooh, fancy laser grid. And it's a tiger bee. According to all known laws of aviation, there is no reason that a tiger should be able to fly. And I just pick him up. Mine. Oh, do I have to now? Oh, but I just got him. Oh. Do I still have him? Yeah. Best haunted building ever. Fuck! Fuck. That was a cheap jump scare game. Fuck you. I hate this so fucking much. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. I'm invincible. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Ah! I keep getting stuck on things. Oh, God. Uh. I was doing so well there, too. Oh, my heart. Oh, my heart's beating so fast. The music. God damn, the music. Alright. Come on, bud. Yep. I know you're there now. Suddenly not as scary, are you? Take the turn. Take the other turn. Take a turn. I'm not even bother reading the text. Screw this. I will escape. You can't stop me. Wait. Oh. I thought that was the turn. Not bad. Fuck. Fuck. Game. This isn't cool. Am I free? Am I free? Am I safe? Am I safe? Am I safe? Am I safe? Uh. I need a moment. Oh, I need a moment. I think I might have even hit my mic. God. Follow the flower, right? Maybe Huggy Wuggy's the only evil one here. Is there another... Alright, so there's another VHS around the place. Oh, do I actually care? That is a good question. Oh, it's there anyways. Might as well. 
Alright. This will play while I'm catching my breath. Final log in relation. Experiment 1006. The prototype. Coordination and cooperation is evidently within his skill set, as well as the skill set of all other experiments of his type. Though still missing, today's events are no doubt in relation to him. His absence was a flaw in the scientific process, which should have under no circumstances been left unaccounted for. That's why I'm making this log, so that the same mistake won't be made twice. Any future experiments will need to be contained and disposed of in a secure location. I'm not worried about myself. One breakthrough and I'll be back. We must forge onwards in the name of science. Whether those who are beneath us understand it or not, end of... Jump scare? Or... Reply end? Okay, so... Huggy Wuggy went evil. Good to know. Can I pick up the toys? No, stop. Turn back. Oh, yeah. Thanks. Oh, on second thought, where the hell do I head? Ugh. Why are we in a house? Oh, we're in a doll house, aren't we? Hmm. This is eerie. Oh, there's a door. And a pillow. God, the color blue is throwing me off because I keep thinking it's the goddamn Huggy Wuggy toy. Can I move you? Um. It's... A tape? No, that's something else. Um... Oh! Um... Hi, Poppy. Uh... Can I just... Leave? Yes, yeah, I'm not opening it. Why the hell would I open it? <laughs> oh... I'm standing, like, five foot back, though. You opened my case. Yeah! Does that make us friends? That was the first chapter. Oh, God. Oh, ha 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 I don't need this. I don't think this needs to be specified because I already kind of specified it. This is my phobia. So a lot of it is just me freaking out. Oh, it, it was it. Damn, the, for chapter one, that was a really good introduction. Oh, that was. Yeah, that was just well done. I, I guess I just have to watch the credits now. This is chapter one, right? Oh, I am dreading what chapter two has in it. I'm just dreading it. So much. And that was it. Can I? Oh. Okay. I guess they haven't made chapter two yet. Oh my god. I love the atmosphere. Creepy as it is, it's really, really well done. Overall, really promising game. Promising game that I'm probably gonna have to revisit and be terrified again from. Uh, with, that all, with that all said and done, 
uh, thanks for watching. If you like this video, maybe check out some of my other stuff. And if you can, subscribe, like, and I'll see you next time. Oh, I hate dolls.